I will now demonstrate for you a sideline closing manipulation for the lumbar spine. Now this is similar in positioning to the opening procedure or gapping procedure, but it's slightly different and has a few modifications that we need to adjust for. Same as before, we apply our piano grip on the inner spaces of the spine, flex up to the segment we're targeting at, back off just slightly to the segment below, extend the bottom leg, hook between the popliteal space. Unlike before, instead of adding a flexion component and rotation, we want to add extension and rotation. So I'm still rotating, but I'm pulling the patient into some extension as well. Another difference we have here from the previous mobilization or opening is the mobilization force direction. So before when I was opening, I was mobilizing like this. The buttocks here and the torso this way. Instead of opening this way, now we're closing down. So we want to mobilize in this direction, like this, okay? So again, find that position, thumb on the spinous process above, the, digits on the, on the digit on the one below, cinch up the butt, load the torso, and take to end range, and manip. And that's the closing manipulation for the lumbar spine on the segment that's laid up on the table.